Nail polish is just for nails, right? Think again. We'll show you how to use it to restore your favorite pair of old shoes. Decorate a candy bowl and a cute fish might appear. Check out these and other nail polish crafts in our new video. Do you have old bottles of nail polish sitting around collecting dust? I have an idea. Take a piece of fine wire. Make a small loop at the end. Make two smaller loops on the other side and wrap with the wire in the middle. It should look like a small fish. Pour some nail polish onto a paper plate. Dip the fish in it to paint it. Let it dry and make a few more fish with other colors. Wrap the edge of the wire around the pebbles. Done! You can use the fish as decor around the house or they can live on your shelf. Plus, they can be frames for sticky notes or photos. This glass vase looks boring, right? Take a palette, a pair of Q-tips, and a few colors of nail polish. Pour out a little of each color. Dip the Q-tip in the polish and apply dots to the bottom and sides of the vase. Place the dots randomly, adjusting the thickness as you want. First, paint red dots. Then add pink. And finish with white. It turned out a beautiful candy bowl. This deserves a place of honor on the shelf. The heels on these shoes seem scuffed beyond repair. But is it really goodbye? No! Nail polish will save the day. Apply a vertical stripe on the heel. Take out other colors and apply those too. Try to apply the strips evenly and carefully without mixing colors. Voila! New shoes are ready! You can even paint over this design again. For the next craft, take a wine glass with a stem and some cuticle oil. Put some oil on the edge of the glass. Drip a small amount of nail polish onto the oil. The polish will spread beautifully. Add a drop of a different color. Continue to decorate the edge with spreading polish. The result is an elegant pattern. When everything is dry, take a white paint and go over the edges of the spots. A hand-painted glass is ready. No one will be able to guess where such a unique glass came from. Now you'll need a plain old phone case and several bottles of colorful nail polish. Put the case on a piece of paper and pour the polish in thin rows. Add other colors. Let it dry. That's how quickly and easily you can make a new unique case. Now you'll need an empty plastic bottle. Draw the outline of a butterfly on it. Cut it out. Take some blue nail polish and paint the base of the butterfly. Paint the edges of the wings dark blue. Use a permanent marker to draw streaks on the other side. Add some bright green strokes. Glue a small round magnet to the base. Done! You can hang this butterfly on a board or on the refrigerator. It's so pretty! Hmm, this pencil is too plain for a bright person like me. Take a piece of paper. Paint a row of polished stripes in the middle. Add more colors. You can use whichever colors you want. Hold the pencil by the edges and roll it over the strokes. Bright, multicolored stripes go on the pencil. This is so amazing! I love one-of-a-kind office supplies so much! These seashells remind me of warm days at the beach. Take one of them and cover it with a gray nail polish. Add white droplets. Paint the second shell pink and decorate it with white stripes. Paint another one with purple polish and add a white pattern. And paint this one with a gradient. Spread the shells on the tray. It's so bright and unique! Can't wait for the summer! 
For the next nail polish craft, you will need a stone and some sea salt. Cover a part of the stone with hot glue and dip it in the salt. Paint the salt with the nail polish. Sprinkle glitter on top. Add a bit of a different color and some shine too. Paint the stone in bright colors from all sides. It turned out an unusual gem, like from a fairy tale. Look how beautifully it glows in the dark. A plain white plate is not interesting at all, but we have big plans for it. Take some nail polish and paint one part pink, starting from the middle. Add a lighter shade. To make sure the polishes don't mix and the edges are even, use masking tape. Continue to paint, choosing colors that match each other. It turned out an unusual decorative plate in a color block style. And you can use it to store your jewelry. Beautiful and practical. Black hair clips? Is there anything more boring? Let's do something about it. Take some bright nail polish, paint the hair clip with it, paint some white dots, and completely repaint another hair clip in white. Cover one more hair clip with polish and sprinkle some glitter on top. You have got a whole set of bright and sparkly hair clips. Now even your hair will look much more interesting. And it cheers you up. Ugh! It's so easy to confuse these identical keys. We need to give them a bit of personality. Take a piece of transparent plastic. Cut out several shapes. A circle, a square. You can choose your own. Cover the circle with white nail polish. Paint black spots like on a Dalmatian. The square will be purple. Draw a white feather on it. Make holes with an awl. Put the key rings on the keys. Now it's so easy to tell them apart. We know where every key goes. Tired of old glasses? Let's update them. Take fast drying clay in brown and white. Roll a brown rope and lay it on the rim around the lens. Flatten it slightly. Lay a white one on top. Also decorate the second lens and take the nail polish. Put a little polish on a thin brush and draw strokes on top of the clay. Paint strokes in a different color. Have you already guessed what it's going to look like? Glaze donuts with a pretty icing. Paint the rest of the frame pink. Let it dry. You can try it on. How do I look? It seems that it turned out to be just what you need. And for this craft, take a souvenir Chinese coin with a hole and, as you might have guessed, nail polish. Cover the coin with a layer of polish. Sprinkle large glitter on top. Add a shiny layer on the reverse side too. You get a sparkling double-sided pendant. So shiny, I can't take my eyes off it. And now you need a small flower pot and red nail polish. Cover the pot with an even layer of polish. Take yellow polish and draw small drop-shaped seeds with a thin brush. Outline them with a black marker. Attach some googly eyes. Put a small succulent inside. The pot turned into a pretty strawberry. So cute! You can give it to a friend. This Christmas bulb just can't be ignored. Take white nail polish and apply a spiral pattern to it. Paint petals around it. Add rows of dots between them. Decorate the other bulbs with similar patterns. Beautiful! I can't believe all it took was some nail polish. Beautiful hand-painted pieces. Now all we have to do is wait for Christmas. Did you like our nail polish crafts and hacks? Let us know in the comments which ones you'll try. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel.
click on the bell to be the first to see the latest videos from Troom Troom Select.